my uh, project folder and uh, it's uh, exactly the same except for G code. I don't commit G code because there is no point. Uh, so the STL is already produced uh, uh, STL files. Balance mount is uh, the remix I did in uh, FreeCAD, which I don't quite understand FreeCAD, so uh, I'm just complying with, your license, with the license you're on your own if you want to uh, modify this. Uh, and yeah, the, the link to original uh, uh, design is in the description. So as for uh, LED light, uh, it uses uh, Noobscad Lib. So if you uh, want to uh, reuse this code, you have to uh, load Noobscad Lib uh, on your computer. So uh, just uh, briefly go over the code here. Uh, th these are all of the uh, global-ish variables that I use across uh, every module. Uh, this is an override for uh, screw sizes for the handle, which I'm importing from here. Uh, since I'm using include and not use, I can actually override screw and insert variables uh, to specify my own. Uh, the the uh, original version has M4 screws. I don't have those, so I, I um, sub substituted with M3. So light base is the thing behind uh, the uh, balance mount. This is the handle code. This is cut for the uh, venting mesh. These are the, oh, I don't want to modify this code. These are the pylons uh, on the side. And you can see the uh, screw size is uh, defined here. So if you uh, want to change the screw size, Select you know, M5 and it will re render with uh, different screw size. So that, that's the definitions for uh, side pylons into which I made screws are um, inserted. Uh, uh, board support for the lighting section, and the main thing here is body shell. Basically, it's one very large cube in which uh, smaller cubes are cut into. Uh, smaller cubes, meshes, and so on and so forth, uh, with the pylons added at the end. And then we have cover, which has uh, toggle holes, and if you want to remove them, just disable them here and here. Uh, also, venting mesh it should probably stay there, and uh, handle here is actually doesn't render a handle it's the difference from the uh, definition of the uh, cover minus handle with the bolts so uh, this will actually it will, this uh, cut the bolts uh, in the handle so he, here this is done for uh, rendering purposes for designing the uh, whole thing now we have uh, parts for holding a uh, 12 volt uh, power supply and LED driver. Uh, why do I have two toggle holes? One. Yeah, that's a little bit excessive, so I can remove one definition. Didn't even get a warning about this. Uh, then we have our shell that just takes the body shells and uh, puts uh, all of the uh, uh, things together like light base in the front, body shell and cover if it's being displayed. Uh, then we have uh, holes for mounting uh, power things on the side of the uh, uh, shell. And then we have like a complete body for design purposes. And this is uh, all the definitions uh, for uh, uh, power mounting hardware that is uh, also has uh, cut holes in it in appropriate uh, places. So uh, if we render complete body, the, the whole thing should show up. Uh, after a while, it takes a bit of time to render.
So, um, there is a, uh, a full render, uh, and if you're designing uh, or updating things, this is very useful to uh, measure where things are. I did not uh, render the light section, uh, but I did render the power, power section and as a form of uh, cubes. I should probably also render toggles, which is there somewhere. Anyway, uh, this is useful for rendering, but actually if you are going to modify something uh, and need an STL, uh, you need to uh, render parts one by one and then export them in STL. So let's try uh, the handle with the two inserts. Uh, press F6 and uh, right now you can see it has room for the inserts if you uh, if you want to um, uh, uh, have a handle and just screw things directly just on command handle assembly and uh, it will render with the uh, inserts in place, place so you can use them to screw uh, your M3 bolts directly into them then uh, cover without handle uh, is here and it has holes for the handle and holes for the uh, toggle switches and holes for the uh, M8 bolts. Then uh, power supply uh, cover for 12 volt power supply bed and with the mounting holes. The same thing for LED driver and the same thing for light body and I'm using F6 as a shortcut to, to render this you can also do this uh, through uh, render menu here and now uh, here's the whole uh, printable body shell that takes nine hours to print uh, and the last thing is the fix for my uh, first uh, working prototype uh, that I epoxy to the rest of the shell. And that's it, and once everything is disabled, nothing is rendered here. Um, good luck!